Okay, this is a video to tell you how to set up a forms box and to use the forms box. We call it a forms box, but it's basically just a public use folder on the machine. Um, when you're done, you'll be able to hit user box and you'll see a forms box or whatever here and you can access any type of document that you scan into it. So you're gonna go to utility You can go to box, user box, new registration. And right here, we're gonna type in the word forms. This is what we call it. You can call it whatever you like. And right here, this is the most important part. Do not auto, del do not delete. That means whatever you keep in the folder will stay in there. And you want to use that because if you put forms in there, you want to be able to keep them. Return to user box list. Hit the X up here at the top. So now you're usually on the scan screen. You hit the user box and there's your forms box. You hit open and your forms are in there. All right. So this is how you get stuff in there. Save this right here. It was a timesheet which is not, but say it was. You would, like this would be a blank timesheet form for your employees. So you take it and you put it up in the ADF and you come back down here and you're gonna do save. And it's gonna say right here, what do you wanna call the document? You're gonna hit clear. We're gonna call this one timesheet. Hit OK. And you have different settings down here you can pick, but most of the time you're just gonna hit start. Just gonna scan it through. And now when we go into forms, and you hit open, there's your time sheet. So now your employees just walk over and hey, I need a new time sheet. And you're just gonna go go to user box. Go to forms, open, timesheet, and right here there's an option for print. And it's gonna say, how many do you wanna print? You say two, you hit the start button. It's warming up. I haven't done anything on this machine. It usually doesn't take this long. Yeah.